Okay, all right, good morning. It's the day after the big snowstorm, and I didn't get done what I wanted to do, or the important thing to do on the David Chin Duster Buddy build, and that was clear this car. Now I was thinking that maybe I should do the chroming on it and then clear it, but I changed my plan of attack on that. I don't want the clear to uh, screw up the chrome or silver or whatever I put on there. So I decided, heck with it, we're just going to go for it today. Uh, even though its humidity is crazy ass. I think they're showing humidity level at 96% and it's hovering around the zero degrees uh, freezing point so yeah. It's going to be a tough day to do painting, but you know what? We got to get this thing done. It's almost the end of the month, and I said I'd have this thing finish at the end of February. Probably not going to happen, but we should be close. I'm going to let the clear dry for probably a week after, but I'll finish off the rest of the gluing of the chassis and stuff while that is happening. Uh, what else is going on? Oh, I was thinking of going to the NNL uh, meet in Vancouver. They have a big NNL model car show, and, but they're t calling for another snowstorm coming up. So that might be out of the plan. Uh, I actually live two blocks away from the event center. Uh, I won't say I live there anymore. Technically, sort of, because I'm living here now in Port Alberni. But my partner in crime, her place is two blocks away. So I can. it's an easy walk over. And uh, she might be leaving that w this weekend. I was going to say that weekend. She's going to be leaving to Korea for a month. So I don't know if she's going to be there or not. And I gave her the keys for her daughter to use. So I don't have the keys to the place, so we'll see how that goes. Especially if this snowstorm comes, they're talking about no ferry service back to the mainland. Anyways, I'm doing blah 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 already. We're going to get a coffee and we're going to get on her and get some stuff done. And, and here's exactly what we're going to end up doing. We're going to glue subframes together. We're going to put the engine in, exhaust on, front. Uh, red I gotta paint the top though cuz two different colors the shroud was kind of a flat and the rat itself is more or less a semi gloss uh, steering wheel put all the small things together and we'll go with that while paint is drying and see how that looks uh, I could yeah look at this I love this love the air cleaner however I wish I could make it removable so I don't know if I'm going to have time to play around with that. i got to put the bottom on yet too. So uh, small things. Lots of... Well, I did get one coat of clear on the body. One side turned out fairly good. And the other side, eh, so-so. I can live with this though. Uh, heating up the paint can. So I will put a second coat on. But when this stuff is warm, it just goes on like water. So I have to be very careful. So I think I am going to put a second coat on. And I did do a little bit of that. Uh, I glued the subframe on there and the air cleaner stuff I'm preparing. Some small things there, letting it set up. But first, coffee. Mmm. This is a really good coffee. Um, it's from Brooklyn. Brooklyn, New York. New York, New York? Or just Brooklyn? Brooklyn, New York. BKG Coffee Roasters. Really good. Uh, Blue Bar Coffee. Not to be confu confused with Blue Balls Coffee. That's a totally different uh, situation there. Um, yeah, coffee's good. It's my favorite band, brand lately. I was going to say band. Get me on camera. I can't speak. That's why we're the substandard leader. Should I show you the clear coat? Hold on. Yeah, this is just a slow shot of the clear. Or a quick video of the clear. And that's what I did. I just threw the clear on the heater. And as it's heating the room, it's heating up my can. And then it flows out really good. And yes, I have started to grow some peppers this year. 
I grew a full tray. I had like 30 some peppers in my other tray. I got two trays and I dropped the tray. So I lost at least 30 to 40 peppers. Only two of them survived, but uh, I'll have to replant some. Anyhow, blah, blah, blah. Oh, that's a tea plant tree, a real tea plant. So this guy I'll put outside when it warms up and uh, it takes about two years to get real tea leaves out of this and I can make some uh, my own tea. Actually one of the leaves fell off when I moved it here a couple weeks back and I ground it, dried it up, ground it up and I already tried it. <laughs> so uh, anyways I'm doing lots of blah blah blah. So I'm gonna, heat's on now. I will, once it shuts off, I'll prepare that for a second shot. And I also got to paint my valance. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Okay, kids, we did manage to get a second coat of clear on to our duster body build. And you know what? It's not perfect, but for what I want, a factory type of look, this should suffice. Suffice? <laughs> Is that a word? Um, I don't know if I'll polish out or not. We'll see how it dries. It's been sitting for maybe an hour or two. So we'll let that go for probably a week before I look at it. Am I even videoing me or just the wall? Chuck, what are you doing? Substandard at its best. Don't forget that. I gotta always remind you guys, right? Uh, yeah, I think it'll work for what I want. So we got that cleared. The other thing was we got uh, a few small details done here. Let me get glasses so I can maybe talk about and see what we did. Uh, got the intake, or er, intake. <coughs> ah, sorry, hairball in my, stuck in my throat there. Uh, the air cleaner is looking pretty good. I got it detailed, the filter painted up. So that is okay with me. Uh, engine is pretty much detailed got the air cleaner or air cleaner my brain is stuck on air cleaner now substandard there we go uh, the oil filter is white da, da, da. we're not going to wire it I don't have that kind of time I'm running out of time as I said uh, interior yes there we go we got the white ball on there white balls check it out Chuck has white balls <laughs> oh I need to do, there's a little oh no there's a little white thing there. I have to dub that in. But other than that, I do like the dash and it worked out good. Interior is perfect. Wow, I'm very impressed. Oh, notice I did flip the spindles to get it lower in the front. So that technically in the box, it shows you to put them the other direction, which would lift the front end up. So that is ready to go. Oh yeah, notice subframe is glued in or front K frame member. That looks really nice. You know, I, I used to have a 440 duster way back in the late 80s. And these floor pans, I didn't put um, subframe connectors in. And it started to put a rip. Here, let me get a pointy stick here. It started ripping the floorboards from there to the leaf spring tie down location. So all the stress and torque from this area was cracking all the floorboards. I was quite surprised. And having a pinion snubber on there. I had a made my own pinion snubber. So it was hitting the floor and causing that to push up on the frame and floor section. 440 dual ferro barrels. Buh, 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 buh. So there's our detailing there. Um, what else? Oh, rad is uh, detailed nicely. I have to do the cap though. Uh, the bottom is going to get uh, the bottom gets glued on. Why am I smacking my lips again? So that will get scraped away to put on. So that is that. So I will put the engine in maybe today, maybe not. I'm not sure. It, it stops snowing, so I might get outside. But one other thing. They did cancel the ferries off the island. So there's no way I can make an NL uh, car show, model show, if I wanted to even. Uh, son of a gun. I wanted to catch my partner in crime before she left to Korea. And I wanted to go pick up my other kits and my electric bike. Or maybe my other mountain bike too. So that kind of screws me over. Because she is hoping to leave 
Sunday, Monday, uh, depending on snowstorm-ish situation. So anyways, yeah, that's not your concern. Oh, the other thing, I did wipe my body down with the tack rag. The car body, not this body. <laughs> um, so these are, I paid like 99 cents or a dollar at Home Depot. So you wipe the body down, take the dust off it. It's a little bees hive waxy, whatever, sticky tack rag. Well worth it. Takes all your dust and you won't have those dust boogers. I always do that. Just like prepping a real car for paint. And this one has nothing. I painted this outside a breezy window. Uh, the thing was, it didn't work out good that clear as much as I expected shiny. Which is a good thing actually. Don't get me wrong. But... The cold air was blowing that minus or minus one or zero degrees wind was blowing as I was spraying so it was cooling that paint down and when it was hitting the body it's already starting to be too cold so it's good thing I warmed it up or if I didn't warm it up it probably would have been cold cold and just coming on like pebbles anyway uh, what else do I have to add let's end it for today if it clears up, I'm going for a bike ride. If not, yeah, I don't know. So that means, what? what's that mean, Chuck? Yeah, cheers, cheers time. Don't mind me, I'm all over the place today. We'll have some little bit of New York coffee. And say goodbye, thanks for watching me, blah, blah, blah. Next stage, we should have all, everything ready to go, ready to put on the body. I'm, I'm looking forward to put the decals on. That's going to look fucking awesome with the decals. Whoops, sorry. So, um, yeah. Uh, little odds and ends. I'm, I'm using Mod Podge on some of the flat parts to give them a semi-gloss look. I might have mentioned that in this video. I don't know. Okay, shut up, Chuck. Let the people go build on my friends. You know what? doesn't have to be perfect. Don't compare yourself to others. Others out there are doing an amazing job, and I know I can't keep up with them, so I don't compare it to them. I just compare it. Am I having fun? Damn right I'm having fun. I wish I should be building more. But there's other things I want to do. And So cheers. Till next time. Thanks for checking out today's video, my friend. And we're going to say thanks for watching. You know what? Cheers. Should we say stay awesome? Yeah, he agrees. Stay awesome and we'll see you next time. Cheers, my friends.